better watch out, you better not cry, you better not pout, I'm telling you why, Santa Claus is coming to town. With little tin horns, little toy drums, rooty toot toots and rum tum tums Santa Claus is coming to town. He sees you when you're sleeping, and he knows when you're away. He knows if you've been bad or good, so be good for goodness sake. You better watch out. You better not cry. You better not pout. I'm telling you why. Santa Claus is coming. You mean the big fat man with the long white beard. He's coming to town. Howdy there, Bronco fans. As promised, we're out here having our holiday special at our favorite place here in Denver, Bill Sports Collectibles. Chris, we got a big game coming up. Two games left. What do you think? We got the Browns and the Chiefs. 13-3. 13-3. Is that not an early Christmas present for the Denver Broncos to get those two teams? Now, I mean, uh, Richardson's played pretty good. Uh, You know, Whedon, not bad for a rookie, but is is there any worry whatsoever? No, as well as the defense has been playing lately. No, it's it's the perfect way to end the season. Everybody gets healthy. You get the bye week going into the playoffs, and everything fits perfectly going into the playoffs. All right, so forget everything that uh, about the matchup, but what do the Broncos need to fine-tune, you think, before the playoffs? We just got to get a little consistency, I think, out of the running game. No, Sean Moreno's yeah. given him more than anybody thought he would these last couple of weeks. Is he consistent enough to keep that going into the playoffs? I think we also have to take a little time to get guys like Cooper. We're going to need Cooper come playoff time. I know Mike Adams a little uh, dinged up and a few other players, so try and get healthy. A couple sure. games at home. Looked like the weather's clearing up. Uh, but, hey, we want to take a little time. It's it's time for the holidays, right? Time to take care of the kids, mom, dad, everybody. Me. So why don't we snoop around a little yeah. bit see what we can find for you Bronco fans. Perfect. All right, so you're heading down to the stadium this Sunday, and you find out, man, that seat is a little bit hard, right? Uh, I need something a little better for my plush little bottom like uh, Chris and Danny always looking for. Now, hey, you can't just get any seat. <laughs> You've got to get a Bronco seat. We're going way back to the 70s for this one. we got some old-school Bronco seats. I mean, come on, seriously. How can you go through Christmas without a Bronco seat? Hey, guys, not sure yet what to get for your wives? giant picture of Eric Decker. If you ever wanted to feel worse about yourself, come on down here and look at how good this guy looks. If you come to Bill's as often as we do, occasionally you can find Bill asleep at the wheel. And guess what I just found? No Sean Moreno, who was on the practice squad, had gotten moved to the discount rack. And they were selling these jerseys for $29.99. And they're still $29.99. So come on down before Bill realizes that Moreno's actually starting and playing good. Stocking stuffer, you still got a Tim Tebow lover in your house? How great are the action figures? So lifelike, so realistic nowadays. Look, even the throwing motion is still bad. Another great thing that Bill's has that you're not going to get anywhere else is old great magazines and programs for the Broncos. Here we got a little Floyd Little, we got a little John Elway, and actually this is back when the Raiders were actually kind of good, believe it or not. And guess what, Drew Soyce, you're up yours, buddy. Look at what we got. A little bobblehead for ourselves. Hey, for the one uh, Charger fan out there, we did find this. I was talking to Bill just a minute ago. This has actually been in stock for six years. So if you want to hurry on down, you could probably get a deal on it because it's been here forever. All right, kids at home, it may be really easy for you to go out and find yourself a Peyton Manning jersey for Dad for this Christmas, but there's only one place in Denver where you're going to go find yourself a Rick Upchurch jersey. How about Randy Gratishar? These are jerseys your dad's really going to appreciate for Christmas. We got Lyle Alzado, and don't forget about NFL primetime, Tom Jackson. All right, Chris, we're going to play a little game here at Bill's. A little, remember, Supermarket Sweep, we're going to do something similar to that. Here's what we're going to do. I'm going to give you 10 seconds to go find the least valuable Bronco thing you can find, followed by the most valuable. So your first 10 seconds, I'm going to say go. I need you to appear back here in 10 seconds with the least valuable Bronco item you can come up with. In three, two, one, you're on. Go! He's coming back. He's got an item. And what does he grab? <laughs> Who is it? What is it? A Brian Greasy plaque. <laughs> that isn't very nice. The guy threw for 4,000 yards one year, didn't he? Does he still play? Yes, he's, he's gone. Uh, doing broadcasting. All right, now, an even bigger challenge. Go find the most valuable thing that you can come up with in 10 seconds. You're on. Go. Get going. 
Hey, so we've had a great time down here at Bill's. We've been goofing around a little bit, clowning on your boy, Philip Rivers. Let's be honest, when it comes to Christmas, there are some classics that just never go out of style. It's the man, Johnny Bronco, picture from the drive against the Cleveland Browns, signed, inscribed here on the bottom, two-time Super Bowl champion and Hall of Famer. Can never go wrong with Johnny Bronco for Christmas. All right, folks, it wouldn't be right if we showed up here down at Bill's Sports Collectibles and we didn't do something for you out there for Bronco Planet. You know, the prize monkey's always giving away prizes every week, compliments of Bill's Sports Collectibles. So we got three prizes we're going to give away this week that we have been looking around. This first one's a set of cards. If you're missing any Bronco card over any year, you can likely find it at Bill's. So here's what you're going to get. You're going to love this. First page is a combination of Dennis Smith cards, followed by Carl Mecklenburg, followed by Terrell Davis, followed by John Elway. So these are some great cards to have to your set. And we didn't want to just go old school with you. We got a couple Peyton Manning things we'd like to give away. Now we know that uh, Peyton Manning became, went from uh, being a uh, pony to being a Bronco. And how great would your kids like this for Christmas? All right, so we got the old school of uh, Peyton Manning and the new Peyton Manning that's leading the Broncos to the Super Bowl, as we all know. And then how about this great plaque that we're going to give away as well? So thanks for tuning in. You know where to collect it. Bill's right off of Broadway, downtown Denver. You can find them online. And at our site, there'll be a link at any time. Go check out what Bill's got to offer and have a great holiday season.